So after doing the PC champion versus Xbox champion with Jinxie, I thought about and wondered what it'd be like to pick the brain of a cop. Now, if you didn't watch that video with Jinxie, basically I asked uh, Xbox champion 10 different questions varying. And from my knowledge, I answered from my perspective as being a PC champion. It got relatively good positive feedback from a lot of you guys. So since there's so little of the siege population in this ranking, it took me a while to but somebody finally reached out. Meet King. He's a real nice guy, and surprisingly, he seems like he should be at least a plat player. But Solo Q has completely destroyed him. If you're on PC and looking to squad up with somebody, King is a real nice guy, and he seems like he relatively knows what he's doing. So his Uplay will be down in the description, and same with his Twitch, so go follow him and show him some love. Let's get right into the video. Why do you think you're in Copper, and how much time do you have played overall? I know I'm in copper because I know it's, it's partially my play style, but um, also there's so many throwers in copper, bro. Like, uh, I don't know what people think when they queue up, but they're like, hey, I'm just going to throw this game. <laughs> why not? He's like, I'm already in copper, bro. I might as well just keep throwing. Like, at least I can get some fun out of it. Like, it's how I feel how some people view when they join up. But uh, so not really all my play style, but definitely partial like i like to run and gun sometimes you know what i mean yeah i'm mean, tired of just sitting there pixel peeking but yeah. uh dude people are crazy in in uh copper yeah and you've been playing you said you you started playing like on console and you were like uh, the highest you got a spot one yeah yeah operation health uh on ps4 it was fun that was real fun and and back then it actually felt like people were trying man yeah like, no it doesn't ever feel like anyone's actually putting forth an effort in ranked at the moment at least in the lower ranks yeah I, I don't know ever since like in my opinion like if you um once bolo started getting very popular um a lot of people adapted to his play style which you know he was like a kid then and he, he went to pro league so he's a lot smarter now but a lot of players went into like running gun mentality and they kind of lost like the you know utility aspect of the game so i i can see that you know, a lot of my teammates they don't use any of their stuff they don't reinforce nope. balls. like it's just like what are we doing here guys are we playing call of duty or what you know what's crazy people actually do that still in plat three um next question is who are your mains uh so i main ash and on defender side i really like ella ella and, yeah ella is the shit dude and i still use her uh it's her smg or whatever the scorpion uh, yeah 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 i got the recoil pattern on that down pack like i love that gun do you ever run ella shotgun yeah sometimes yeah sometimes i do okay yeah, i just i feel a little bit more badass when i use the smg just because it's got such crazy recoil did you play her when like uh she first came out like back in blood orchid oh yeah yeah oh, yeah, yeah she, mm -hmm. she was she was very good yeah, she was one of my first characters I dropped to Ace with. If you had to sum up Copper in a few sentences, how would you sum it up? Like, what is Copper like, basically? The most trolly place on Earth. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, if you really want to if you really want to test your solo play abilities, solo Q Copper. If you can climb out of Copper by yourself all the way up, like, yo, kudos to you, bro. That's good. I've heard I've heard people say that uh, copper might be hard than harder than diamond. I've I mean I've never been to diamond, but I can tell you it's pretty hard with all the Smurfs and I mean a couple hackers. I I mean shit. I logged in the other day and it was like you've got 200 elo rolled back. Stop. I'm like bro in copper though. Like seriously. <laughs> you gotta be pretty fucking bad to still be in copper and then be cheating, man. <laughs> the next question is who is the best hard breach operator in your opinion? Oh, dude, uh, me? I love, uh, Thermite. Okay, okay. I, I, I was expecting, like, an ace in your, like, no, no. No, I'm, I'm OG player, dude. Thermite for the win. Okay. He's always, he's always been solid in my book. His gun is amazing. It's a laser beam with a fucking scope on it, like. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people, like, especially, like, when Ace came out, they just, like, forgot about Thermite, and I, like, I, it pisses me off so much because he's just, like, the best hard breach possible, and now he has smokes. So I, I, he's even better now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, next question is who do you think the best operator is on attack and then on defense? Mm, I really like, uh, sledge mm -hmm. for attack. Cause, uh, I love just boom, busting down walls <laughs> coming in or shit. Uh, you know, what is it? Uh, the maps with the is it consulate with the garage breach where you have to like throw the grenade into the the hole to blow up the fucking bandit charges yeah and shit. yeah that's my favorite thing to do like the other day i was playing there and i think i was maverick 
and I threw a nade through the hole. And this is how you know I'm in copper, bro. I got a kill with the grenade because the guy was sitting in the corner in the garage. And I took out all of the fucking... Uh, the the, the, the bandit wires? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I was like, oh man, that's how you know. <laughs> so there was a no ADSs by the drone hole. No, and the guy was sitting in the corner. You know yeah, yeah, yeah. Talked underneath. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was just sitting there in the corner because I watched the replay. I was like, where was this guy at? He was just sitting there, bro. He didn't. He heard the grenade and everything. Didn't care. Okay. Okay. So on defense, who, who's the best operator? Uh, again, I'm. I really love Ella, but I know that she's not like the best. Yeah. Um, dude, <clears throat> I gotta go with Doc. Doc. I, I played. I played with the Doc yesterday. And I swear, dude, I've, I don't know how long I've been playing this game, but this guy actually healed our teammates. Whoa. Like, went, out, went out of his way, bro, and was stimming everybody as we were getting hurt and picking people up and shit. It was cool. And that I was like, oh, wow. I was like, that's a little faith in the community back. So I feel like people really underestimate operator like Doc. A lot of them rather pick like an operator like Rook. And like, I, I really hate Rook as an operator, to be honest, because I don't think his armor really does as much as like Doc can do. But people no, want to use it for the 2.0 uh, scope. They want to like spawn peak. That, that's the problem with a lot of people. They're playing for themselves and not the team. Mm -hmm. Like when I go into a game, like it's not, oh, I'm not picking an operator because that's who I want to play. I'm looking at my team and I'm like, okay, well, you guys all just randomly picked whatever you wanted. I was like, now I'm going to go with what the team actually needs. So I end up like... I like last couple days, I've been playing Jaeger mostly. Mm -hmm. on defense what, what do you, nobody wants to play. What do you think of his recoil? It's awful now. Yeah, and, yeah. And they reduced the mag size, which mm -hmm. is even, even worse. Yeah, I, I'm having a hard time with it. Days, I miss the days when he had, like, no recoil, like, a big mag, and he had the ACOG. Mm -hmm. ACOG is where it's at, dude. Uh, what's, yeah. what's your opinion on KD? It doesn't really matter. Okay. Like, some, some, some people live by KD. I mean, I play video games to have fun. Mm -hmm. you know? I mean, not saying that when I'm in competitive that I'm not trying, you know what I mean? But it's not the thing that I worry about at the end of the day. Like, if we're in a ranked match, like, if I don't catch a couple bodies, that's fine. As long as I put my utility out and I help the team. I'm pulling call outs, you know, watching cameras, whatever it is. As long as I'm participating and helping the team do what they need to do. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's a team game. That's the whole thing. It's a 5v5 team game. Like, it doesn't matter about my KD. I'm not the shooter. Yeah, that's a, that's a good answer. A lot of like gold players and even plat three players I know for me, I used to play Xbox. There's something called an LFG post, and it's basically like, it, it's like Discord, it, kind of, but you can put like little posts and be like, uh, looking for four people, gold one, uh, one point oh KD. And when I first started playing the game, that's all people cared about. You would join their party, they'd invite you, they'd be like, what's your KD? And if they didn't like yeah. you, they're kicking you. There's other ways to test. Like I would rather just see how you play in a team environment yeah Honestly. yeah okay like, i mean if, if you're not good at, at catching bodies then maybe you're good at setting up utility or you know helping the team Some, there's something you can do yeah you know I mean? yeah okay okay i did it seems like even though like you're the lowest rank in the game you seem like no, you the lowest, yeah like yeah like i i think the highest um i think i saw you were like silver four and then you dropped down and like that that is rough um I was with my friends, yeah. yeah it seems it seems like you relatively like you know what the game is about and like a lot of gold and plat three players they they actually don't so like i respect that i actually don't think you should be in copper from just the answers you're giving me um you should definitely be in a higher rank so kudos uh um so the very last question is casual or ranked more fun in your opinion if i had a team i would only play ranked for sure mm -hmm. okay okay um, i uh i don't get it wrong like like you said you looked at my tab i play a lot more casual than i do ranked but that's just i'm in copper hell brother <laughs> yeah you would probably play more casual too 100 percent. yeah uh and even then like i've been finding myself playing quick matches just because an unranked the unranked casual people can leave and like your team doesn't get filled out so you're just getting stomped yeah all uh, right yeah so, yeah there's so many people that just leave over stupid stuff or you you'll i'll be even being ranked dude we'll win a match like win the round and someone leaves like yeah people just don't care they just turn off their like pc and they're like i'm out i'm leaving yeah. now if you guys enjoyed the video make sure that you like sub and comment and if you want to see this like a series comment down below what you would like to see next besides that this is garfield's doc thank you so much one love